Zeebs, just got back from main training. Oh, everyone wants to know how you went. Did you get through? You're putting your hand up to play this week. Uh, yes, I am. Um, got through training. I, uh, I've ticked every box I've been asked to tick. Um, I was very close last week, um, but the guys just took a no-risk approach um, going forward. And I think uh, in contention for that was the guys realised that we're going to be playing a lot of back-to-back -back games the next few weeks. So um, minimal risk in terms of injury to be able to play. And um, I've got through training very well, feel really good and fully confident that, that I'll be playing on Saturday night. Is it news today that uh, the whole uh, life will, up here will be extended by another 60 days? How's that gone down with the group and players in general? I think pretty well, to be honest. I think our group is really understanding of the situation we're all in, and um, we understand that, that unfortunately for people in Victoria that they're a lot worse off than, than what we are right now. We're fortunate that our industry is still going, uh, and that we're able to, to contribute to that. Um, and a lot of people in Victoria are really hurting and struggling. Um, so for us to be able to, you know, continue what we're doing is is really nice. Um, and. Not to say there hasn't been challenges with that, and there will be some challenges coming up, no doubt about that. Uh, but we'll work through that as a club, and, and as a club, I think our mindset's really positive. We're excited that we get to start keep playing footy, and um, it continues on Saturday night against the Tigers. Do you expect that all the players will stay up here, or is it pretty much just one of those case-by-case -case scenarios that as we get through the 60 days, there might be some circumstances where some people and staff need to take into consideration that they might have to go back, or whatever it might be? It's definitely a case-by-case -case, um, scenario. Um, each individual player's got their own circumstances, and different family issues and stuff they have to work through but but um, you know Shory and Brody and, and our club is really accommodating for everyone um, and by no means uh, is any one player locked into staying up here for the whole 60 days um, if circumstances arise that they have to go home then everyone's more than happy to, to accommodate that so um, it's a definitely case by case scenario but right now everyone's really keen to stay um, everyone's really keen to get stuck into the football side of things and unfortunately we, we haven't been performing the way we'd like to over the last month and um, again Saturday night's an opportunity for us to turn that around yeah what does the captain have to say about the the on-field form at the moment it's hard uh, when you're not playing um, but I think the messaging um, from myself and, and definitely from the coach um, is that you know we just need to keep improving. Um, last week was a better showing, I thought. Our effort around the contest was really good and it was there. Um, we just lacked a little bit of execution um, in terms of our skills and, and definitely going inside forward 50 as well. So we need to give our forwards every opportunity to be able to kick a goal. And, and at the moment, we're probably shooting Big Brownie in the foot a little bit with the way we're going inside. But um, we've addressed that this week um, in, in the review and, and the training this week's been outstanding. So it really is exciting to be back for myself individually because I, I feel like I can have more of an impact playing than I do watching. Um, but for our guys to get that opportunity to, to get back on the winners list, I think it's really important. All right, mate, great to have you back. Thanks for the chat. On your ethos.